Hi, this is Jim Whitley from the World Famous Tool Shed, located at 1073. I don't. I can't believe I didn't remember my own address. 1073 Main Street in Worcester. Hours this week are Wednesday through Saturday, 1 to 5. Uh, all the information can be found on the website at uh, use-tools.com. And uh, what else? Uh, Instagram, Worcester underscore tool underscore shed. All right, so let's get rolling. we got drill presses here. One of them might be sold tonight. I don't know which one that might be. We got 140, 110, 110. We have the Irwin box of um, drill bits with a couple extra ones in there. And this is $30 for that set. The uh, Makita, the Makita um, compressor is 200 and 20 no it's 200 dollars the belt and disc sander is 25 dollars bosch uh 12 inch miter saw is uh 220 dollars the mag light is 13 dollars and 50 cents the turbo pump is uh is six dollars there is still some of the uh router bits from last week left in the box and they all vary in price they start at probably five dollars and go up uh, there's the Rockler Jigget, which is fifteen dollars. Uh, Workmates, they're ranging in price from ten to twenty-five dollars. The eight-foot, three-hundred-pound ladder is eighty dollars. The uh, six-footer is uh, forty dollars. Little Stanley Toolbox, twenty-seven fifty on the top, twenty-five on the bottom. Ten dollars on some lights, seven fifty on the soldering kit. Jet dust collector, one horsepower. This is two hundred dollars. The bench grinder, I think, was seventeen dollars and fifty cents. Uh, dollar on the chalk blocks. Another toolbox, fifty-five on the bottom, uh, twenty-five on the top. Turning tools, twelve dollars and fifty cents. The crown turning tools are one hundred and thirty-five dollars. The uh, Gerstner box is one hundred dollars. Bargain table this week is at a dollar. Some spring clamps I need to put out. This is a roll, 250 foot roll of Romex uh, with the date of 2002. So contractors, you know what to do with that. I have the 100 piece Evercraft set. I did not put a price on that. I need to look that one up. Um, Craftsman bag, $4, $2 on these clamps from the Harbor. The heavy duty hang alls from Husky, 36 inch, those are $17.50. The Surge Master 2 with the uh, eight outlets from Belkin, that is $8, I believe. Uh, $6.50 on the plumbing um, valve set. Oh, I forgot to price those. The uh, this four magnetic trays, and I forgot to put a price on the eight. No, it was $9 on the Ryobi router bit set. $10 on the adjustable dado blade. Big trowel, $6.50. The molding tool, $2. Dollar on the level. Dollar fifty on the metal level. Another tray. Needle files, two sets, $4 and $4. The Zircon I-700 uh, scanner. This is $25. We have, we have a chisel, which is $6. And we have a turning tool, which is $5. And it does have a handle on that. And did have a name on it, but I can't read it. Tape, $1.50. There's another roll of tape here somewhere. Painter's tape. I don't know where the hell it went to. Um, Pliers, dollar fifty, fifty cents on the drill index. The filter wrench is uh, six dollars. The porter cable. I'll see something else. There's the there's my tape down here, and that's dollar fifty. The porter cable screwdriver set didn't put a price on it. Of course, we're off to a really good Monday so far. Sixty dollars on this top box. Got a box of clamps. Oh yeah, I forgot about all this stuff I put out. Whole bunch of bow saws I put out last week. Um, I can't remember I put this out last week. I don't think I did. Anyways, nice, nice belt. And what's the price on that? $22.50. Got 
grease guns, bolt cutters. Um, there is a torch in there. Come alongs, trowels for days, a chain come along, pitchforks, whole bunch of shovels, uh, gardening tools, post hole diggers, leaf rakes, more shovels, more pitchforks. Back to business. Uh, we have the saw, $5. Another um, metal tray, don't have a price. This is a metric, um, it, it won't be a zero to one, I think it's zero to 25 millimeters, is that what it says? That is uh, $10. Steak anvil, 50 bucks. A Stanley, 100 and a half hand plane, this is $110. Uh, Bessie clamp, $2.50. Hatchet, $8.50. Stanley number four, $35. Um, $5 on the Greenlee Snake. The uh, number 51. The hell, I didn't put a price on that. I'm, I'm really, I almost want to start this thing over, but I've gone this far. I can't go back. $3 on the uh, strap wrench. $12.50 on the, on the torch tip. $13.50 on this torch tip. Hammer is $2.50. $1.50 on this little tack hammer. $2 on this tack hammer. This, uh, I think, was $5. It's a paintbrush, and uh, I closed it up, so I don't want to reopen it. $3.50 on the, on the um, leather punch. The mallet, $4. Bucks. There are some uh, pruners, $4, $6.00. Clamps, five dollars on this guy, five dollars on this guy. The Craftsman bar clamps are three dollars each. The toolbox is seven dollars and fifty cents. Air tanks, seventeen dollars and fifty cents. And its big brother over here is twenty-five dollars. Uh, there's some lights; those are two dollars and fifty cents each. Uh, the lock is five dollars. Uh, dollar on the Tie down, twelve fifty on the blue point um, um, file holder. Or scroll saw, fifty dollars. Whole bunch of uh, vices, forty five dollars. The Xylus, I think, is forty bucks. Twenty two fifty on this guy. Twenty dollars on this guy. This was a Wilton, I believe. Let me just double check that. That is a Wilton. Twenty two dollars and fifty cents. Uh, Fifteen dollars, thirty dollars, six dollars, fifteen dollars. Whole bin of. Um, Little crappy extension cords, those are a dollar each. Uh, $11.50 on the drill press vise. The sharpening tool or the sharpening blade holder is uh, $6.50. What am I missing over here? <laughs> Nothing. We have this homemade box. Guy did a fantastic job way back in the day when he made this. That is $40 for the box. There are a bunch of end mills in there. There are a whole bunch of taps, a whole bunch of dies, anything else I need. Um, there are carbide tips there, and one of those carbide tips probably goes to this um, lathe tool. This is $10 on that. Uh, we have a start plumb bob, which is $35. This is a 515 MD. Um, I don't know what makes this one so much different than the 515, but it is different, and... I guess more rare or something. $9 on the Southwire uh, electrical tester. The Sheffield Footprint um, Tool Company little cleaver. This is $5.50. Pexto seaming tool, maybe. The question mark on that, that's 20 bucks. Center finders, the start ones are $4. The other guy here is $2. And lastly, we have a start a uh, little inside. Oh, that one's broken. Well, we'll have to work on that one. I guess that is lastly, but it's uh, not mostly. So anyways, uh, oh, there's this Lansky sharpening kit. This is 20 bucks. There are some other clamps, $5 on those guys there. Some other bar clamps, and there's a whole bunch of bar clamps there. And there's a whole bunch of bar clamps to the right of the uh, shelving back there. So there's bar clamps all over the place. Carpet stretcher, $150, come down and get that. All right, I think I've talked enough. 
Wednesday through Saturday, 1 to 5. And that's about it, folks. Thanks a lot.